Butterfly gon' recap this and say God he caught a 30 on the dime road. So all y'all wanna know what happened, I'ma tell you what happened. He got smoked. That was crazy out there. Thomas Peter, nobody that knows body. Hit his area with 51. Everything in the fire flies. When you start rapping like that. They wanna know what we like. I'm trying to see what she like. The red light, green lights, the beam on. I used to wonder what it be like. It's a dream on. They won't catch me at the red light. My team on go. And that cat on, you get your leg on. You gon' go. The city watch, got y'all find a shooter. They don't know. You already know what it is, man. Salute to the subscribers, that notification gang, etc., etc. Don't let none of that get too far ahead of you. Click and blend. Follow me on Instagram, by the underscore fly. Tell your mama I said hi. Salute to every one of y'all. Hope y'all enjoyed your holidays and things like that. Yo, surf, ARP, like what, 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 what y'all be having going on? Like where this energy between y'all be coming from? Like for the past couple days, they've been going back and forth on, I mean, on Instagram, on Twitter, you know what I mean? Twitter, the Twitter verse, they've been wilding like, uh, uh, and I'm gonna just give you my perspective, you know what I'm saying? Like, this is just me. I'm just a nigga with a camera dipping from the slammer. It is what it is, you know what I'm saying? This is a blog. So, <laughs> from what I saw, was Surf originally tweeted, uh, back to RBE you go, when he put Calico versus his battle stats on Twitter. And basically, you know, it, the, the Twitter verse saw that Sue Surf was basically saying that Calico got 30. You know what I'm saying? All the rounds was uh, Sue Surf winning by a lot. In a lot. And this is what I said. I said this about Sue Surf. I said it to him, and I said it to y'all more than once. If he, if he finds his groove and he becomes what he's supposed to be, like not this two rounds, Sue, show up with two rounds and then hit you with the O, I ain't want to battle him anyway. Like, dog, nobody cares about that. We're not doing that. Like, I didn't even care about him or, oh, my my AP is, is flooded or my... Dog, we don't care about that. Like, that's cool. You know, you got nice chains. The music is dope. I fuck with your music. But but we don't... That's not what that's not what it is. You know what I'm saying? Everybody got nice shit. You know what I'm saying? So, he basically is now starting to take the game the way it's supposed to be taken serious. You want to battle rap's biggest stars. One about the biggest stars cannot not show up when the lights are the brightest. You can't show up on the biggest cards with the biggest names, the biggest events, and then drop the ball. Like, it just, life don't work like that. Like, you get loaded lugs, drop the ball. 40 bars, she's the biggest female battle rapper ever, drop the ball. And there's mad other battles. So he's basically reevaluated things, and now he's taking the game serious. And I got a whole lot of respect for what he's doing. You know, took John John serious, three rounds. To Calico serious, three rounds. To many, himself especially, he feels like he's 6-0. and no, He hasn't lost a round versus any of them. You know, I could debate and go back and forth and break down things like that, but it is what it is. That's not what I'm doing here. So, Surf says to Cal, you know, back to RBE you go. So, you know, RBE is represented by ARP. ARP is a proud, proud league owner. You know what I'm saying? Like, he's going to hold, if the ship was to sink, He's going to still hold his flag up. They've been through the ups, the downs, the hate, the block battles. The, you know, if you tell the MCs, if you go over there, you can't come back over here. Tell the niggas that, yo, you go to the event. I, yo, like all types of goofy shit happens inside the industry. Like you guys, if you knew, if you knew, 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 knew the calls that people get, telling them not to battle, telling people not to go to the events, telling people not to support them. And these are all black businesses. Like I, 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 me personally, I recap whatever. If it's fire, I'm recapping it. If it's fire, I'm talking about it. I don't care if it's URL. I don't care if it's RBE. I don't care if it's King of the Dot. I don't care if it's Bullpen. I don't give a fuck because I'm, I'm independent. You know what I'm saying? I own all my shit. If it was the end of the day, this will all go to my kids. I own all my shit. So it don't matter to me. But you see the pending that's happening between leagues and between uh, individuals. So, so ARP responds to surf. Saying better than sitting out two years turned commentator while blaming a building echo and an unsuccessful music career. Yo, 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 yo. He was big ARP fires the scud missile. You know what I'm saying? You don't waste no time. ARP writes all capital letters and shit. He puts the shrug emoji saying, you know, back to RBE is better than your failed music career and blaming the building echo. 
Like, woo, 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 yo, cat, AR, woo, what are you doing? Like, what, what? Yeah, you know one thing that I will say about AR, because this shit is funny. I ain't gonna lie. This shit is wild funny. They've had back and forth. This is like take 53, you know what I'm saying? Like, I think as Surf said one time that you could book me, you, you'll pay me, I'll come spit on your floors all three rounds and leave. Like, this is, this is not no new shit. Like, this been going on between these two. And I will say this. Sue Surf is mad URL loyal. In his battle with Cal, he even dissed the, the fact that artists go to RBE anyway. You let these million view bitches go over to RBE on stage saying, do you believe? Like, he was dissing them then. And he said KFC. He called the, he called the league KFC. He surfed stay trolling and talking shit about R, RBE. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's what he do. Like he, and the reason why ARP responds... Because Sue Surf is a big name. He has a huge following. So when he says something, it means more than, you know what I'm saying, uh, Crucible Charlie saying some shit. Like, that shit don't go nowhere. You know what I mean? But when a nigga with a huge name and a huge following is bombing on you, you got you kind of got to respond. You know what I'm saying? So ARP says, better to sit now two years, turn commentator while blaming the building echo and an unsuccessful music career. And then he says... Uh, you know, they, and they was going back and forth for a little minute, you know what I'm saying? Um, so ARP, uh, <laughs> uh, he, he, so Surf, you know, Surf is going to go back and forth with him, you know what I'm saying? Uh, he, so he says, Surf says, why would I leave battle rap? I commentate for URL when I'm not battling, you sound hurt, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's basically saying, nigga, you sound hurt, that, like, that, that, that's what I'm doing, you sound hurt. And then, uh. You know, he said uh, ARP was like, and realized the checks he can only sustain, he can get only can sustain his apartment from good old battle rap. He couldn't get his lease with any of those mixtape preferences, saying that basically that like, he's not eating no bad. Everybody eats B. You're not eating. Because he realized he tried to leave battle rap for it. And he realized the only checks he can get to sustain his apartment. You are an apartment, nigga. You ain't got a house, nigga. You said, ARP's basically saying, you ain't got a house, you got an apartment. Some apartments are nice though. It depends on where you live. You know, some niggas be having condos and shit. You know what I'm saying? Nice apartments and shit. You know what I, mean? I got a house. You know what I'm saying? But I'm saying I've lived in apartments before. It's nothing wrong with. Anyway, let's get this shit going. So, uh, so AR, so Surf then responds saying, you know, I'm not leaving battle rap. You sound hurt. And then uh, ARP says, hurt? Not at all, sir. I am a fan. When I watch some of URL's cards, you keep me entertained between battles. Sometimes you come off a little nervous and you wound up like Vince Carter's commentary. You'll get better with practice. You'll get better with practice, saying like, you know, you, you, you gotta you gotta work on you gotta work on your shit. It's basically saying what he's saying. Uh so Sue Surf shows, you know, I guess inside the studio, inside the, the, the crib, the, the mansion, whatever he got going on. It says and I'm starting staring at the ceiling in the studio that I own inside the lounge that I own, working on these rounds. Your day going well. And then he says, uh, not bad, actually. ARP says, not bad, actually, deciding which of these seven bathrooms I'm going to go take a sh in. I skipped the gym today, so I guess I can walk eight miles to the furthest one to get some light cardio off. You know what I'm saying? Um, and... You know, they, they just kept on going, you know what I'm saying? So Surf says, I personally am more of a penthouse, high-rise type of midtown guy. I'm sorry, I don't want a house right now. My bad, my G. And so, you know, RBE, Rare Breed, salute to ARP, goes on and says, My target is not the style of a penthouse, condo, ranch, high-rise, detached. My target is ownership and a price tag given all them change you rock on your neck, keep up. Turn that lease into a deed, then get some zeros behind it that monthly, and you will be on your way, young man. And then Surf says, you know, um, he's saying that, you know, he thinks the penthouse is not rent to own. You know what I'm saying? Like, Surf is renting to own his penthouse, and then ARP goes further and says, rent? What? Rent? Nigga, you paying rent out here? Buy Surf. Like, nigga, you paying rent? And then uh, Surf says, buy Weasley. Calling him, not be, not Beasley, but... Weasley, you know what I'm saying, and 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 it, it just went, for, and who knows how far they went, you know what I'm saying, like they just was going back and forth. Um, I will say this: it's interesting because uh, Sue Service is own independent brand, like he does music. He's battling too at a high level, you know what I'm saying. Like he's battling, and when I spoke to him about battle rap, 
He did say, like, you know, this year he was going to take shit seriously. You know, everybody's getting three-round clips. Don't expect no difference. Like, when you see him versus Twerk coming up soon, you should expect three rounds. Expect Like, don't expect nothing different. Uh, but he's standing up for URL because when ARP takes his shots at them, and they both take shots at each other, you know what I'm saying? Like, they, they, they both. Do you believe... Everything that goes on, you know what I'm saying? Like closure shit, they all have strategic shots that they take at each other, you know what I'm saying? Uh, you'll see artists, big names, go over to RBE in battle, and then you'll see some come back, you'll see some won't. Uh, the most notably is Ill Will. Ill Will, dope MC, he could be tearing shit down on both sides, but the way they probably look at it now is like, nah, you over there, stay over there. But Ill Will should be battling everywhere. Ill Will shouldn't be giving an ultimatum like, oh, you can only battle here, you can only battle there. That man got kids. Them kids don't care about what league you battle on. They care about Christmas. They care about their food. That's a whole nother story for another, another day. You know what I'm saying? Which is why I blog on every league. I don't give a fuck who league. I ain't, I ain't co-signing nobody. If they do good, you do good. Do bullshit, you do bullshit. It is what it is. Um, So you see Surf standing up for URL because... Smack ain't never going to be online going back and forth with no, rap, with no rapper. It's never going to happen. Um, Beasley's not going to be online. He might do a little petty shit here and there. Like, I think him and Gwitty had a little spat. But that's not, he's not going back with no high-level battle rappers online for the public eye. Why? Because they're owners of a huge company. If Smack was to go back and forth with fucking whoever online, nigga, that's going to be 100,000 view blogs. Niggas are going to become boom, 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 boom. That shit's going to be going crazy. So they know the position that they're in as to why they cannot do what ARP is willing to do, you know what I'm saying? ARP, he's willing to do that because he's like, a lie, you know, the, 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 a lie that's not defended becomes the truth. So if you let niggas bomb on you, let niggas talk crazy about you, and you ain't standing on that or standing, you ain't, yeah, everybody's a step until the step and get the step into them. If you ain't stepping to the niggas and stepping to you, it's just gonna start looking crazy. So that's why ARP defends his shit. He defends his house, you know what I'm saying? This is his house, his grass, his lead, his lawn. He gonna defend his shit. You know what I mean? He's like, yo. And then, oh, it was another one that uh that caught my eye. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, this shit been going on for a little minute. This is not no new shit. Like this, that's that's a crazy thing. Uh, ARP had had said as far as Sue Surf, um, with the Calico battle. You know what I'm saying? Sue Surf, he was saying you finally getting money now. You know what I'm saying? Like you find you ain't out here looking like a broke ass nigga no more. He ain't say that specifically, but uh, you know, he said something that was kind of like. You know, like like kind of kind of guy kind might have might have got to him a little bit. So uh, he says, "Hey, Calico, you can tell when a nigga feel like he getting paid from Master after all with Mad L's, all the work he put in. Tell Lil Surf you was making that versus Ill Will and Big K five years ago on RBE, saying nigga the money that you making now, nigga niggas been making that money. B, you just getting paid like that." And then, you know, Calico said, I let people think what they want. And Calico's like, yo, man, I'm getting money on both sides of the street. Nah, I'm not going to, and I respect him. He's like, nigga, I'm not getting looped into that shit. Why not get a 30 piece here and a 30 piece there? That makes a 60 piece. I'm not going to block my road and get money one way. I can't get money the next way. Because when y'all niggas ain't got no money, I can't get no money from these niggas. I'm out here with no money. Now, fuck that. So I respect what Calico's stance is. He's looking at that shit like, nigga, huh. I let people think what they want. That's great. But uh, I don't think there's no end game to this because Surf not only this is ARP and RBE, he does it on the biggest platform. He'll literally be on URL stream on caffeine on a Drake card or on a big ass event and he'll call out RBE like in a heartbeat, no questions asked, you know what I'm saying? So um, I do got respect for both, you know what I'm saying? Like I said, when Surf do his music, I'll listen to it, I'll, I'll talk about it. ARP, when Red Breed does their events, you know what I'm saying? I'll recap the events and all that shit too, you know what I'm saying? But I do think this is funny as hell <laughs> that they keep going back and forth, you know what I'm saying? And now it's like, my nigga got seven ba Seven bathrooms, my nigga? Hold on, let me count one. I ain't got seven. I know I ain't got seven. I got four, respectfully. I got four, respectfully. I ain't got no seven, my nigga. What the fuck you doing seven bathrooms, my nigga? Like, seven? Where you put them? He might got a big ass house. But anyway, it is what it is. Um, salute to all of y'all for watching this content, whether religiously or passing, if you made it to this moment. Um, be thankful for everything that you got going on. Your family, your friends, your kids, 
uh, your job situation, you know what I'm saying? Just stay 100% faithful in God and things will work out for you. Uh, you know, and uh, salute to my guy, Showtime SP. And, uh, you know, we'll be back. Drop some more shit in a quick second, you know what I'm saying? I had uh, a little off day today where I had some time, you know what I'm saying? I had to address when it's time to, and now I got the time to times two. Go! They wanna know what we like. I'm trying to see what she like. We red light, green lights to beam on. I used to wonder what it be 